When that plane disappeared, we died a little along with our girl. We found grief supported our church. Thankfully, that helped ease the pain, but there are no words for that heartbreak. My mom died with that heartbreak a year before we returned. Oh, how awful. I'm so sorry. We were more blessed. Or at least I thought we were. Maybe you could tell us about how she was when she came back. Distant, closed off. She no longer carried God's light. We couldn't connect with her. My mom had some tough times with me. It's hard to help someone when they're not ready to be helped. It was more than that. She wasn't the same. She was losing her mind. The more we tried to help, tried to pray with her, the more she pulled away. One day she packed up, passport and all, and left. We think back to New York, that's where she grew up, but uh, it's been months and no word. Folks, I think Angelina might be in danger. How... Are you in touch with her? No, um, I can't explain, but I can find her. Okay, so according to passport control, Angelina never re-entered the U.S. after going to Costa Rica. Weird. Parents said she went back to New York. Maybe she wanted her parents to think that she went far away so they wouldn't keep looking for her? So Intel was able to run Angelina's social media history and found a couple deleted accounts. Looks like she had a friend down in Costa Rica back in the day, um, Elena Rojas. God bless the internet. Uh, get me a phone number. On it. Hey, guys, fun trip? Fun while it lasted. <laughs> Okay, talk soon. Yeah, good find. We hung out a bit after the plane came back. I tried having dinner over there a few times, but her parents were still so clingy. When was the last time you saw her? A few months ago. I figured she went back to New York. She always talked about going. What else? I don't know how to explain it. She was distracted, almost paranoid, looking over her shoulder like she was being followed. Her parents didn't mention that. They're so strict and religious, I'm sure she was nervous to tell them. Did she ever talk about being followed or give you any details? Look, it's important to tell us anything that you might know because she didn't go back to New York, Elena. She's still somewhere in Costa Rica. That's seriously all I know. You don't think someone really was after her? I don't know. Look, if you um, hear or think of anything, you have my number, okay? So was she really being followed? Or was she just having a calling? Or option number three, the calling was trying to warn her about something. 